Yo, Beckett, my man. Hey! You're not supposed to talk to me. Oh, I will destroy you. No, no, please, Sentry Bot. I'm just here to check out this beautiful White Spring Resort. I'm Bald Eagle. Did you get it? Haha! <laughs> Once I'm through with you. Mm -mm. Oh! I welcome you. I hope you're doing fine. I am kind of doing fine and we are playing some more Fallout 76 for today. We are going to take a look at how we are going to free Beckett and after that we will see what we're going to do next. Now it has been a few couple of days and some things have changed, some things are new and allow me just to show you around first. The last time we went to the three biggest buildings way up on the top somewhere in the ash heap. And we actually found a mining headquarters, which inside we unlocked the plans for an excavator power armor. And as you can see on my left down bottom, something has changed. Well, I actually figured out how to change the UI of the power armor. There's actually very simple an option in this game where you can just turn the uh, power armor option on or off. Or just basically say switch it to something that is lesser covering your screen. And with that being said, I actually have the excavator power armor completely built. And I'm just going to stand out here so I can just use my middle mouse button without going into the camp. Look at this beautiful. Now, I thought getting black titanium was the hardest thing. I actually found a workaround how to get a lot of black titanium instead of just killing more miners or visiting different mines, trying to find some ores. And I'm just gonna explain you all about it and when we are done um, with that, I'm just going to go to free back it. Instead of just killing more miners and get the scrap suits and you know, scrap their suits, I thought there must be a mine around in this area where you can actually have black titanium veins. Well, there is actually one, it's called the burning mine and oh boy, this burning mine is even worse than this um, responders mine which is also on fire. You have to go down, press a button and get the heck out of there. That's a part of the training mission of the fire breeders uh, responders. Now this mine down here, I got a lot of damage and not by the enemies wandering around there, but, but um, with the fire, there's so much smoke inside, I can't see stuff. I've been wandering around for a little while, I couldn't find any black titanium ore. Now I have once showed to you and you know what? Well, let me just go there within a second. Um, there's actually a little machine which sells maps. Maps of, I don't know, 40 bucks, uh, 80 bucks, and 120 bucks. I'm just saying something. Uh, these maps, if you, you know, activate this map, it will show you a marker on your map. If you go there, you dig out what is there, you can actually get some resources. You can get 10 titanium, 15 titanium, and 20 titanium, depending on the um, value of your map. So I went doing that, and it was pretty easy to get titanium. Well, what was the thing that was very difficult? Screws. Screws in this game is very a difficult thing, because everyone wants them in order to modify the weapons, craft the weapons, craft armor, and power armor. So it took me a little while to get this suit done, and uh, I also got the um, a legendary skin onto this, which makes it look pretty cool, all golden and silver, and of course red. I think it looks very nice and uh, this power armor has something really really cool uh, something very neat and that is it gains plus 100 uh, weight let me just show it to you here excavator bonus carrying weight plus 100 and I have been on places fighting enemies and this power armor isn't that bad actually it has maybe lesser um, health and other power armors but this thing is just freaking amazing of course this power armor also has its other downsides uh, for example you cannot have a jetpack onto this thing but if that is all then i'll just take it so yeah i also got a new weapon i don't know how i got this new weapon uh, somewhere playing the game uh, later on i even found another one and this weapon is replaced did replace the black powder rifle legendary which uh, had a double projectile there's only one thing that can be better than that and that is the quadruple barrel 
um, black powder rifle. It's, you know, if you can see it for a little bit, it actually has four barrels onto this thing. And this weapon is actually called a dragon. This thing is pretty amazing. Let me just see if I can... Yeah, so it's still used 50 caliber balls and the fire rate is just one. Uh, it takes longer to reload, but it has a lot more damage, about 200. This thing is pretty awesome. Imagine having a legendary one of this, including a double projectile, including area damage and all that kind of crazy stuff. Um, I think it's pretty cool though. Another thing, I got this legendary run, um, you know, continued being done. And uh, I sooner or later, I'm going to need to figure out this white spring resort. Because there is one thing that I'm going to need a lot, and that is kill legendaries. So at this moment, here we are. And I'm getting closer and closer to this guy. And, uh, oh man, I'm very exciting for this down here. Ah, uh, this suit looks so freaking cool, though. Um, the sooner or later we will get there. Now the point is, uh, how do I get out? Tap, and then I get back in. Press the arrow keys. So the point is that claw is not a problem. I did one last night in Dead Claw Island. Um, level up is not too much of a problem, but still. Um, but as you can see, it's weekly. I need to kill legendaries, and legendaries is kind of hard to find. And um, they still recommend this one place. White Spring Resort. Yes, I got this on my map. Um, so let me just explain it very short. Someone dropped once again a nuke bomb down here. I spawn out here at the Blackwater Mine just to be safe that I'm not immediately in the irradiated zone. I put on my hazmat suit and I just went near this road down here. And a little bit on the to the terrain, just at the entrance. Um, I wanted to find like these nuked plants. All these plants were just changing, and the point is, I wanted to collect plants in order to craft a jetpack for my T45. Um, I wanted to see how this will work. Uh, I needed to have cobalt and that kind of stuff. Now there is only a bit of a problem, and that is that you need a lot more than just cobalt. I'm just going to show it to you real quick. Ah oh, man, get out of the sting. Get out of the sting. So down here he got nuked flora. I actually had a 52 of those things. I had a few of these. I had a few plenty of things down here. Now the problem is plants is one. You need to have glowing mass. Glowing mass you can get by killing nuked enemies. Hearted mass, nuked enemies, high radiated fluids, nuked enemies. So you need to do a lot more in an area where they, you know, nuke the whole place. And I didn't want to go too far into it because the White Spring Resort is something I would like to discover together. So I had to abort the mission. I was kind of disappointed that I need a lot more. Um, but in this case, it is fine. So that will be enough about that. So I'm just gonna use this power armor, I should actually, you know, I could say store the other one, but it is fine as it is. So here we go, we are going to find and rescue Beckett. I'm going to spawn out here in Lewisburg Station, I haven't been doing anything else than trying to get this legendary one done. Um, you know, I didn't discover new places or anything like that, I just wandered around trying to get a lot of screws. And I'm thinking of it. I need to register my excavator power armor. We have a workaround, right? We have this backdoor key. Okay, this should help, I'll guess. Just remove the uh, targeting uh, stuff. Here the. I wish you could, you know, say like, okay, only attack goals or something. Uh, but that needs to be a very smart system. So. I was sharing your ass. What? <laughs> I don't know what is that is all about. You gonna be a good? Wait, they were shooting each other? What? They were shooting each other. Oh. Ow. What? I don't wanna, I don't wanna, I don't wanna get my loot. You saw trying to stick it right up her robotic hole. 
I don't want to do this, man. This is dumb. Maybe I could do this. Oh, I need to be there. Oh, fuck. I wanted to say maybe I can do this. Be very, very carefully. Just. Please. Bitch is hiding somewhere. Can I close this door? What you mean, fail? Oh. Power almost. Oh, finally! Finally! I got his power armor station plan. Wow! After so long time. I got, by the way, another pump action shotgun from a random event. I've been searching so long for that. This thing, go away. I'm saving this up for my, uh, my system. Alright, so. In this case, I have, by the way, how much ammo left for this thing? Look at this, I got a lot of ammo. <laughs> Is that all? Ah, more of you. Oh no. 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 I'm not going to follow the roads like a nice guy. Get screwed by another Assaultron. So far, Assaultrons are really... Well, at least for me, it is the most badass thing. Because... That could kill you in a finger snip, man. It's... Like, even the Scotches aren't that dangerous. Like... They can be... You know, do chaotic attacks and stuff. But they're really not that dangerous. Not on this level anymore. This Assaultron just drains my health like it's drinking a cold beer on a sunny day. Just gone. Shh. Oh, just wild meat. Shh. I didn't say anything. Ow. Ow. You cannot hit me. But I can hit you! Shouldn't have a big head like that. But this is it. That's a uh, big machine down here. Oh, here's the camp. Look at that. Rollins Labor Camp. Alright, so far my bat system doesn't pick up any movements. Check in! Okay, it doesn't seem like anyone is here. Maybe someone all cleared it out or it was already doomed and it's like Beckett doesn't even know about that. Um, this tent will protect me. <laughs> it actually does too. I mean, it's a lot of fallout so much, man. I already wonder what's gonna be the next Fallout game, where and how. You know, what would be funny if they make the very first Fallout, but then of course in 3D. Just like this, I mean, how cool would that be? Okay, okay, um, so let's... I thought we were friends. Huh? Hey! I'm um, Bald Eagle. You get it? <laughs> Alright, let's see what's in the, this gigantic machine. I always love it how there's another door as him for safety. You don't get blown in the face straight away. <sighs> it is Beckett. Yo, Beckett, my man. What are you doing in here? How did you get yourself in trouble? Hey! Hey, you! You need to let me out of here. Look, 
I need to get out of here. Okay, these blood eagles are gonna kill me, but only after they mess me up. You get me? No, it's not gonna be pleasant. Yeah, let's have a little story first. Why are you here, Beckett? Oh, for the love of... Alright, quick version. Okay. <laughs> I used to be part of this gang. I left, they nabbed me, and now they want to make a lesson out of me. How's that? No, that sounds fair. Now you're talking. Quick, the key should be around here somewhere. Alright, probably in the room where the guy running this place sleeps. Be careful. Please. Alright, alright, alright. Let's just uh, find the key somewhere. It is right up here. Back at jail cell key. That wasn't too bad, I mean... Uh oh. Ow! Okay. Oh, there you go. Oh, yeah, the nice little kitty cat sleeping back. Oh, thanks. Oh, we're not in the clear yet, are we? All right, listen. I need to ask you for one other thing before we get out of this place. The gang took a bunch of my stuff. Hey, things that I need in order to track down their leaders. Can you help me get them back? You sure it's your stuff, or are you tricking me into stealing something? Uh, let's just do that. It's mine, okay? I've already spent too much time gathering information on these idiots. I can't afford to start over. Believe me, if I wanted you to steal something for me, I'd be straight with you about it. Good. Alright, I'll run interference while you get the heck out of here. Just distract those morons. You know the drill. Where should we meet up after all this? Do you have some sort of place where you're squatting? Or... Okay, sounds like a plan. Okay, but, 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 but I need you to build something uh, that I can recognize from a distance. If I see it at your place, I'll know I'm welcome. In my bag, I've got a sketch of something that should do the trick. You'll know it when you see it. I overheard they took my stuff to the sludge works. Now, it's not too far from here, I think. Okay. Wish me luck. Okay, good luck. Well, in this case, don't mind if I just spawn out here and then we walk over past the mountain. Then we have a good overview of what's going on down there. Yep, that is this place and I'm exactly spawned on the other side. Very good. I don't mind if I just walk around there. In my uh, live stream, there was like a... Uh, what is it called? A Scorch Beast level 50. One legendary star flying above this area. And I need to get some uh, treasure out here. Ah, oh, the door has been open, so someone already been here. So if this door is closed, it will open, and there is like a glowing one behind there. It was kind of chaotic, man. I was walking from up the mountain, then I saw a flatwood monster. I shot it once, then I heard flapping wings. There was a scorched beast. Tried to haul ass away, but of course I was in this T60 power armor, which they care that I cannot run. There were a bunch of super mutants following me and shooting on me, and this scorched beast was attacking the mutants. And uh, I came to this place. There were like a, uh, a bunch of ghouls. I got attacked by cave crickets, and there was a Vondingo, and... Ah, oh, there you guys are. Alrighty then. Who goes here? Me! Who goes there? You, in your next life. Oh, that's funny, like now it's all of a sudden starts to becoming far cry with these uh, alarm buttons. Nothing! Ah, thought it was another attack. Oh, the only thing that sucks. Ha! The dog! The 
fuck. Oh no no no. Mm -mm. Oh. oh you wanna play big? You wanna play big? Ah! I can play big too, big guy. Automatic laser pistol, that makes sense. Uh, where should we place this? Well, I guess this would be a nice spot though, for now, just... No. Only half hour start, would you like to scrap the wonder at the start, you? Yeah? Okay, okay, okay. It's such a shame you cannot have multiply allies. Hey, Beckett! That is quick. Help Beckett. Right past wrongs and deal with the blood eagles. Um, well. Okay. Oh man, I miss her already. My own bar. <laughs> Finally. Man, I still can't believe it. Me either, Beckett. Um, so we now have you, right? But. But, 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 but. Alright, just a but. The point is, I don't want to continue this just yet. We will, at some point, do all of the side missions and get all of this done. Um, of course, I can imagine I need to do uh, back at first before going to another ally, so... Um, oh! Did I? Let me just see something. I think I have... I forgot to show you something, something new. Yeah, I saw a bucket list note. So, here's the whole point. I went back to the Nuka world, and in the Nuka world um, parking lot, there was a guy laying on the floor with a Nuka world t-shirt. It was very random. Normally, he doesn't lay down there. And uh, this guy had a note with a bucket list. Now, the point is, want me to make pictures. I don't know if I have... Yeah, look, camera. I can make camera films and I can make a Pro Snap Deluxe camera, which basically means um, I have to make pictures of certain locations. I will just take this note. Oh man, it's a shame I didn't do that at the beginning of this episode. But as you can see here, he done a few certain things. Uh, we need to make a picture of Harper's very old armory, Freddy's House of Scarce, which I think I know where that is at. I'm not sure. Uh, so there's a lot on this list that needs to be done. It's like, you know, a little side quest. But I have also noticed that in this game, take the camera pictures of different creatures. So we need to, you know, there's a lot more going on. And if you got 76 pictures of creatures, you get 80 atoms. But, you know, you, you get the idea. It's like a fun little thing to keep in mind. I'm not going to do that right now. What we were going to do right now is we're going to explore the White Spring nice. Resort. It's a pretty big area though. I uh, once spawned out here with someone as a camp and I noticed this whole area is White Spring Resort. I don't know yet. I think this will be the line. Just like so around here and then somewhere about there. White Spring Resort. There's a resort. Let's see what is inside. I w have wanted to do this for so long. Like, this area is supposed to be crazy. Are, are you guys friendly? I mean... Oh... <laughs> Please? I just want to discover the area. And by the way, let's take some of these... Um, Go for white spring, white spring. Is that all? That is all. So let's check it out. Hey! You're not supposed to talk to me. Oh, I will destroy you. No, no, please, Sentry Bot. I'm just here to check out this beautiful white spring resort. By the way, this is the entrance. There's like a big building there. Now, the strangest thing about this area is you can see the grass. Look how green it is. Look at the flowers. The white spring is under our protection. So yeah, I've been reading like if you want to have screws or whatever, this is a perfect area to, you know, try to explore. Like look, this is big. This is really big. And I believe this, yeah, this even exists in real life. There's like a real life bunker also underneath and I believe uh, at the beginning uh, of this whole game stuff, when it's, you know, 
certain YouTubers got invited actually to that building in real life and they were doing like fallout stuff there oh boy oh even his hand scanners is that okay just to go how the hell do you oh stop being a go go <laughs> oh look look at your goal Jesus, no wonder there are a lot of legendaries to be found when a new blast comes here. Let's see this down here. Just paint? Do they paint everything? That would explain why everything looks so good, right? I've been seeing that on TV ish that sometimes they just paint the grass green in order to make it look good. Mr. Ainsley, I wanted to remark upon the fascinating design of your new Spring Hill golf course. You appear to have seven holes. Seven. What a curious number. Nine, I could understand. Or perhaps six played thrice. But seven. Most courses put ever so much effort into varying their holes. You will appear to have liked your third so much, you repeated it immediately. Or take the cart paths. One normally takes such little note of them. I had a wonderful chance to reflect on that during the three-mile drive from the fifth hole to the sixth. And then seven. Ah, seven. Such a slope. It would make a fabulous ski run. Not that teeing off with the 400 yard putt wasn't a unique experience. I confess, when I heard you had carved up your championship golf course for housing tracks, I was concerned it might have impacted the quality a little. Clearly, I underestimated the scope of your ambition. Cordially yours. Henrietta Winchester. Yeah. Ah, oh, you're just opening the door to make me. Ah! How about that, you silly ghoul? Alright, that will be that. Oh! For now! Calm down, Betty. But I wanted to check this out. Annette's arrangement. Oh, that means like a flower store, right? Arrangements, flowers. Oh, what are you guys? Let me just collect one of these. So oh, maybe for a achievement in the game. This is vintage. Oh. They created their own museum of showing off stuff. A very clever idea. Um, I'll just wait with that. Okay, very nice. This is the Blue Ridge Gallery. Ah, oh, just gallery, I see. Uh, wait with that. I mean, sure. This is Klaus and Co. A lot of bells are too in this game. Oh, look at that. Very nice. Klaus and Co. Madame Steelers. Ah, very nice. A Madame store. Deco. Decorate. Decorate, okay. A little. Decoration store. Ciao, you glowing piece of shit. Oh! I... You're just living in peace down here. White Spring Golf Club, so... It's not just... It's a place within a place. Excuse me, ma'am. Madam. <laughs> oh, ghouls, man. I love it. Rotting. Okay, bad idea. Okay, 
Enjoy the free arrangement. Uh oh, what happened there? Uh? Ow. You stop coming from the back. How many more of you guys are in here? Look at this. A mine. Wakey, wakey. What in the fuck is that? Why? Okay, bad idea to get in here. Oh, this is so bad. Really bad and a lot of ow. You just stay the fuck over there, you son of a bitch. Uh, mind my swearing though, but this is really bad. <laughs> Even dropping from the ceilings. Ow. 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 He just like, oh, wake up. Jesus Christ, go down. Oh, yeah. So here we have another Halo tape. They keep coming. They, they just keep coming. Rob. Rob saw them first. Three. Just, just three. Out on the seventh. Easy shots from up here. At first, we thought it was fun. Tried to see who could, who could pick them off. Extra points for the head. <laughs> then, then Rob went missing. Went down to the range. It wasn't far. It wasn't, wasn't back by dark. Then Ted, Zach, Zach, Phil, Mark, God, Mark. They dragged him. I can, I can still hear him screaming. Now we're three. Just, just three. Can't run. Can't hold. Can't. They're coming. They're coming. Uh oh, -uh. they're coming. Attention, citizens. Okay, I'm glad Nuclear it's not here. Imminent. So this is what I'm going to do. I'm just going to leave it with this. The next time we will start off continuing exploring White Spring Resort until a certain part. And then we're going to take a look at the list of the side missions. And we're just going to start completing all of that stuff. For now, thanks for watching. And I'm also thinking about... You know, I've been doing this live streaming. Live stream one was camp building. Live stream number two, which I did for me at least, was last night. Uh, you know, I did a lot of treasure hunting, I just got all these maps, I did found an extra one, but I didn't want it to go uh, 